Greetings and salutations, tube dwellers. I come through a, a thick snow uh, and many dangers to attempt to find a musical instrument. These wolves look like they don't want to give up. I kind of feel like I need to collect some firewood. I'm a little bit worried about this climate. I am in the pale. It is one of the harsher climates in the game. Lydia, you be careful now. Oh my god, there's a bear involved. I had no idea. Let's go ahead and start with the wolves, though. Take some of those quick wins. Get the overall damage intake of my party. Cut back. Go down, you beast! Oh, it's cold enough out here uh, that I ponder taking my axe and carving myself out a nice little warm bed for a moment. Uh, there's still something here. What, uh... What still threatens us? Show yourself! Hidden assailant. Oh, did they kill this horker? I just rode by this guy just a second ago. Is that a wolf? I think it's one last wolf. He's being skittish. He's probably smart to be. Whoa. Gotcha, wolfy buddy. And guess what? Lydia's got you even better. Oh, that didn't land. But Lydia's got it. Now, where in the hell is this cave? I want to get inside with the quickness. I don't see any trees anywhere nearby. I don't even know how that works, really. I have not yet gathered firewood with the Frostfall mod installed. Hobbsfall Cave, it says. With plenty of blood spilled around the entrance. Never a good sign. Lydia, let us approach cautiously. Uh, I see bodies. I see bones. Hobbsfall, I'm thinking... Who is that? Lydia, did you hear that? My god! It's a woman! We have to save her! Uh, yeah, there's definitely some necromancy going on here. Uh, that means that there's a very high possibility that it is, uh, some necromancers and or vampires inhabiting the cave. Oh, oh, I think she already knows about us. Oh, not quite fast. Oh, it did sneak attack! Sweet! And she used to be a necromancer, but, uh... Now she's a uh, necromancer's little buddy, actually. In just one second, she is going to be a necromancer's best friend. Now this should use a lot less magic now. Oh my god, it uses so much less. That is amazing. And she's going to be a spell-casting zombie. That's the best kind of zombie. You'd think they'd resurrect with some kind of stupidity that would just cripple any chance they had at being effective with the magical arts. Oh yeah! I would think casting shock magic, things would get warm really fast. The release of energy would just be astounding. It would warm your very bones. Some bad looking robes. I almost want to take those black boots just because they're black. They're not uh, shinily golden like the ones I'm wearing now. I feel warm. Apparently standing by a brazier. I'm in a cave of ice. Literally surrounded by ice. But it's okay. I feel warm. Let's go ahead and make sure we get the sneak attack off. And let's go ahead and put the necromancer... Oh, I wanted to say out of his misery. Oh, whoa. I see you, baby. I'm trying to shoot them arrows. No, sir. You shan't get an arrow off on me. Doesn't even have eyes. They're trying to tell me he can aim really well. Whatever. Uh, there's not a proper way down here. I could drop down if I wanted, but let's just proceed. Oak flesh. It's a spell I already have. Let's see if we can get a touch off. Oh! Oh, he is frost. I don't like frost, but that's okay. I think frost magic does interact with frost fall means if uh, it both takes your stamina and slows you down that way and then makes you cold and slows you down that way. 
dealing with a lot of movement speed impairment, you're basically going to be locked in place. I see the skeleton. I would really like to get off a, uh, a little shock here. I don't know why my followers aren't coming. I may back up to get a hold of him in just a moment. Oh, God, he's a frost mage! Oh, don't push me. Don't push me back down there, please. Wow, I just barely dodged a couple frost bolts. Oh, man. A couple ice spikes, if I had to guess. That is really nasty. Let's go ahead and put a ranged one in this hand. I'm going to use... Oh, he just moved. I don't have the magic to keep this going. My zombie's doing great, though. Let's just hang back. Let's watch things unfold. I'm a necromancer after all. Or at least, uh, I guess I'm, I'm more of a destruction mage. But I aspire to be a necromancer. If I aspire to be a necromancer, then I should learn strategy. He is a necromage. I suppose I could get in here and give a hand. <laughs> Go ahead, finish him off, Lydia. He's all yours. Robes of conjuration! I do conjure fairly often. You know what? Let's take them anyway. I don't think I've got that conjuration plus magic enchantment, so... We'll take it for that purpose. Don't use enough conjuration to uh, deem them worthy to wear outright. But there may be a point in time in the future where I want to put that enchant on some robes. And again, robes of conjuration. More skellies. Where are they all coming from? Looks like a frozen cave, but it must have been a crypt. Whoa, Enchanter's Primer? Wow. Oh yeah, enchanting improvement. And that means character improvement. Getting them levels. So I'm going to go ahead and let you guys do your thing. We'll take a peek around. I guess we can go through there with the pull chain. Uh, I think I can get rid of some weight, though, in my inventory. With a few disenchants. I'm wearing the shock resist. And uh, I think it's probably worth wearing. And I guess that's all I can do. Okay, that's uh, fine, though. You freaky biatch. Bone meal. Yes. I probably won't want to do anything with bone mold armor, but... Why not snatch up the bone meal? We're getting deep. We're getting deep. I'm completely warm again. Oh, man feel our altitude dropping. What do we have? I see you. I'm going to go ahead and make sure that I get the sneak attack off. And you know what? I think I'm pretty close to being able to wipe you out. Is it going to be frost? Don't let it be frost. Don't let it be frost. I don't want frost. No frost. Wow. Soloed. Oh yeah. This didn't stand a chance against me alone. I don't even need my helpers. The Exodus. Teach me that restoration. And I think we're almost done here. Let's go ahead and snatch this level up while we're down. Magicka? Yeah. Let's keep going, Magicka. Not really, uh, not really feeling displaying out all rhyme and reason, but I'm feeling the magicka. Bound weapons become stronger with you. That'd be cool if you use bound weapons. Can summon creatures three times far away. Uh, I plan on doing most of my summoning on the location of a corpse. I guess I should go ahead and get harvest. Um, I haven't leveled up destruction enough yet, right? No, it's still only at like 43. It seems like it's getting to level really slow. I'm not even at 50 yet. I'm still using the spells of that range even. Um, restoration, I feel like I'm close for a couple things here. Respite would be nice. Um, that's one that I kind of prioritize all the time now. Uh, I would like to go ahead and move up to the uh, next level restoration. Being able to cast a single spell and fully heal myself would be cool. I'm not going to be able to do it until I get that perk though. So Conjuration or uh, still not on sneak so it's Conjuration or one handed and, and that I think means that it's Conjuration. Alright well I am now all the closer. Oh, matter of fact, I've got the skill for Bone Mastery. I can use Harvested Bones to animate Skeleton Warriors. An empty petty soul gem. Interesting. I'm going to have to check that out very soon. wonder how much stronger the skeletons are, or 
I wonder, comparably, uh, how strong the skeletons are as compared to your slightly buffed zombies from my special reanimation spells. I am not sure. There you are! I was wondering. Glad you're still in it, Miss Zombie Neck, but, uh, it'd be really nice if you shut up. The moaning is unbecoming of a an aspiring young necromancer. Oh, God! The fire! I hate how... I, I, know, I try this. I try this all the time. I don't understand how, how your shout doesn't knock these crystals right out of place. You can knock them out with an arrow. You can come up with a weapon and attack them and knock them out. I don't get why the Fusra Da does not cut it. That's an adept. I would like to do the touch. Oh, it's gonna hurt. I'm glad you're using Ice Spike. Oh, she's trying to use a smarter one. She ain't gonna get it, though. Oh, and that power attack in the back. Go, Lydia, go. She's slicing and dicing. I love to see it. With enemy AI improvements comes allied AI improvements. And that is all A-OK -okay with me. What do we have here? This is not as simple as I think it looks. Let's go ahead and see if we can hit. Oh, it was the apprentice. That's cool, though. We'll lock him down. Oh, I don't think I got the uh, the front runner there. And let's be careful above all else. Uh, Lydia, if you'd like to attack, yeah. you should probably go around the rock first. And then we can talk about uh, you doing damage. There are four necromancers here. Wow. With those uh, recent improvements in Conjuration, I feel like I should just use a lot of it. With this high number of enemies, why don't I just get a high number of summons on the field? And then see if I can do a little damage on the back end to a couple specific targets. Whoa! That need to go down a little bit faster than normal. That necromage up there, he means business. So do my puppy dogs! How do you like doggies? Little neck? Oh, it hurts! Oh, please don't do it again. I'm gonna let the dogs finish that off. As I come over here and take a chill pill. And hill. Chill pill hill. It's the best kind of hill. Take a picnic basket up onto the top of that hill. Chill out. Have a pill. Are we finished? Can we grab the loot and go? Uh, flute. We already have the loot. We've got the loot and the drum. Oh, dude. Wolf. Dude. Dog. Dog. Uh, so I wonder. Are you, are you too powerful? I feel like... I feel like this dude's too powerful for me. Yeah, he is. I'm too low level. That means I should not have whooped your keister, but I did. Gave your keister the whooping it has always desired. That's why he became a necromancer after all, right? You knew someday you'd be struck down. Pantea's flute! I have it. Uh, so we can get something. I think we're done fighting anyway, but I just have a- I have a desire! I have a need! A requirement! Let's take the apprentice! Hello? Oh! Oh, I didn't hold it. Didn't hold it long enough. Gotta hold it a little longer. We gotta wait. I gotta tap. There we go. Tap the foot! Just a few times. Wait on Christmas. I have an apprentice now. Yeah, I've got a house car and an apprentice! I'm getting stuff done. Maybe next I'll make a house and get a steward. Black Soul Gym, I almost missed that. If I wouldn't have ran back down there, tried to summon a uh, zombie for no apparent reason. Oh, an expert lock, Christ almighty, can we just get the loot anyway? I don't wanna... Oh, I can harvest what? Let's do it. A bone, foot, rib cage. oh my god! Oh my god! I'm so glad they don't have good animations to accompany that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, the animations were right. Oh, Jesus. What just happened right there? And how, how does, is Lydia just gonna turn her head? The way town guards are supposed to once you become a Thane? Is she just gonna look away from that? God, I've gotta, I've gotta just assume that she would be absolutely flipped out. You know what? We're, we're really close to this stone. I say we should go up here and have a peek at it. We should go up here and reveal the point of the stone. 
And honestly, the stones have been changed. I don't remember off the top of my head. Uh, I think this is the tower stone up here. I don't remember what it's been changed to. Whoa, that's not exactly what I want to be happening right now. I want touch to be happening. I'm feeling a lot better about my, uh, my choice to go lightning lately. Just using the touch spell a lot, that I think helps more than anything else, any other one factor. But uh, also just that my magic pool is getting higher. Then I'm getting the, the right perks to make the damage higher and and uh, I guess give me some magic reduction. Alright, yeah, horse, good idea. Why don't I get on the Ibex pony? He can climb mountains. I had trouble getting up this just a second ago. What do you want to bet that he's just going to be like, well, uh, we'll just use an extra wide point of origin to fool the game on what level it thinks we're on, and we'll just go ahead and pony on up this mountain here. Woo! Oh, 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 we're so close. Come on. I know you can pony up this gorge. Okay, maybe we can go around it. We can pony around it. Well, let's pony back. Oh, yeah, there it is. There it is. Good ponying. Going on. Yes! That's how we climb mountains around here. Oh, God! What am I doing? Oh, no! Oh, I had tunnel vision! I was looking at the stone! Oh, noes! Oh, noes! It's alright. We can pony back up. I'm pretty sure. Somewhere around here. <laughs> I'm flying, Mom! I'm flying! Okay, let's try to stay somewhat in the middle of this area. And let's go ahead and get off this horse before I go too wily and screw myself up. Now, I'm going to take a chance here. Uh, I guess it's not a real big chance because there a quick save just happened. Uh, but I think I remember this correctly, and I want to do it. Uh, let's 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 just wait a second. I will still do it blind. The tower may seem impregnable, but those under its sign can almost always find a way past any locks and barricades which stand in their way, automatically opening expert or lower locks whenever necessary. Huh? Expert or lower? I just now passed up an expert level lock. Whenever necessary, does that mean that you can do it more than once a day? That sounds awesome, especially for somebody with low level lock picking like me. I don't think that uh, helps your fingersmith skill though, so not gonna do it. Not gonna do it. Want those skill ups, want those level ups. Now, uh, I will very blindly, uh, I think I've got it about right. Woohoo! Dive off. Is this, is this gonna be right? Oh yeah! It was right. I was right on the money. Oh no. Oh man, I'm very cold all of a sudden. Uh, I just got wet. I was thinking about the fun of the situation. I wasn't thinking about the real life consequences. Can I pick wood up from anywhere? I think I've got to. Do I have to equip this bad boy? Let's equip it anyway, just in case there's something that I miss. Can I just like. Can I hack and slash? I can harvest that spi spicy grass. I don't think I can pick these twigs up. And I think that might mean trouble. I may be in a bad way if I can't find a tree and find some kind of campfire. Or uh, create some kind of campfire very very soon I don't know suppose I've never seen the ultimate consequences of uh, Frostfall working against you come on there's so much wood yeah I know I'm really cold I'm really really cold and continuing to get wet is probably the worst thing that I can do but uh, I'm just trying to check all my potential sources for uh, wood here I'm not finding it I may have to dodge into oh boy here we go. We have to dodge into a uh, nearby crypt. Go away, wolf! It's an ice wolf nonetheless. Oh, it hurts! I do not want to be messing with these wolves right at the moment. Let me see if I can get myself in a little crevice that they have trouble getting to. And while they're fighting the horkers, I'm going to take a little bit of advantage of the backside. There was another one. He ran off that way. Where'd he go? Ferocious little devils. They wait until you're feeling weak, and they come out of the woodwork. Hey now, Lydia, there's no reason to- no, not the horker! Oh, the poor guy. Oh, it's such a shame. There's so much blood. God, you're such a fierce and unforgiving mistress. Ah, uh, so there's a crypt over there. That actually seems like shelter, and seems like a good idea for that sole purpose. But uh, it's further away from civilization, and I don't see any wood. Oh, still getting wet. Oh, what's this? I see fire. What is the fire from? This fire. Snowflakes begin to turn into freezing rain. This fire looks like it was from a dragon. This doesn't look like it was from, or maybe not. The sky's clear as the snow begins to 
cease falling? Is that what that said? Yasira. Huh. And a book. I think that was a spell book, right? Wow, I have a lot of spell books. A lot that I know. Huh. I have quite a few to sell, too. Which is nice. The gold is always nice. I'm still interested to try to find a tree and, like, I don't know. Uh, even if I don't have to now, act like I have to survive. See, see how it goes. See how a little campfire goes. I should probably make a tent next time I'm in town. I am now freezing to death. I'm very wet. The air is frigid and deadly. I've got frost all over me. I don't know how this works. I don't know how to get lumber from the trees. How can I make a campfire if I can't scavenge materials from the world around me? Wait a second, what is that? Is that the sound of a forge? Oh, thank God. A fire. Oh. I'm so frozen. Oof. I'm already drying off. I'm warming up. It's a close call. I think I need to uh, get my survival supplies in order for the journey ahead. That's going to be it for this episode. Everyone, thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more.